My name is also Yao. Thursday born. Ifi Natalie. Uh, I was born on Friday. If Africans would use their resources by their own, they would be the future. Yeah. yeah. Have you gotten married? Not yet. <laughs> what are you waiting for? It's a German tradition, you have to wait. Yeah, Germans yeah. wait longer than Ghanaians. I talked about the languages. Yeah. We think maybe there are too many languages in that in one country. Germany is bigger than Ghana and we have only one language. Asigwazi no gubuyele makaya Amantwa nabaya kala ubisilu pelile Abato tinezi mpimpizi ya kataza Ibu shungu matota lendava ya se Afrika Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ambassador Vix and I visit the interests of Ghana and Africa. You know, you know how you always do it. We cannot be people who try as much as possible to showcase Africa to the world. I have two great friends here and I'm about to ask them about Africa, their perception and what they think Africa is not the new world. And as a matter of fact, whether they lie to them, whether Africa is the real Africa or they are experiencing a different Africa. Once again, my name is Ambassador Vix and I visit the interests of Ghana and Africa. Hello, you're welcome. Thank you. So, you say Akwaba. Akwaba. What's your name? My name is Yanis. Yanis. Yeah. What's the meaning of Yanis? Um, it's a Greek name and I don't know what's, in, what's the meaning of it. All right. My name is also Yao. Yao. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you know the meaning of Yao? Yeah, it's like um, Thursday born. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What, what about you? What, what about you? My name is Natalie. Ifia Natalie. Ifia. I, I was Ifia. born on Friday. Ifia Na Naftalin. Natalie. Yes. Okay. What's the meaning of Natalie? Natalie is like, it's like Christmas. It's like Christ is born. Christ is born. Yeah. Nice one. <laughs> okay. Where are you guys coming from? Uh, we're coming from Germany. Which part of Germany? From he's from Cologne. Yeah. And it's the central Germany. Yeah. Central, middle part of Germany. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And I'm living like more south, and I'm living in Mainz. Okay. So what do you do in terms of your occupation? Um, I'm working as a paramedic in Germany. Paramedic? Yes. Rescue service. Like in an ambulance. Yes. What about you? I'm in the advertisement for some health organizations. Like for yeah. NGOs? Yes. Yeah, global organizations. All right. So for how long have you been here? Um, now it's like one and a half month. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And we are staying nearly two months here in Ghana. Yeah. So you, you people are basically couples? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Have you gotten married? Not yet. <laughs> what are you waiting for? <laughs> we don't know. It's a German tradition, you have to wait. Yeah, Germans yeah. wait longer than Ghanaians, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Germans wait longer than Ghanaians. Don't rush into marriage. Just study the person and make sure whether you are good to go or not. Maybe you might have had some perceptions about Africa, specifically, uh, specifically Ghana, when you're coming from your own country. So what were some of the perceptions were you, were you having about Ghana or Africa? Um, they love music. We, yeah. And love to dance. Yes. Yeah. And we accepted it to be hot, hot yeah. in Germany, because when we, left, when we left, we had like two degrees. <laughs> um, a lot of happiness. Yeah. And yeah. Okay. Well, with the um, perceptions, all these things are positive, positive. Maybe you might have had negative perceptions about Africa. You, you have. So what were some of the negative perceptions? Um, there are more poor people than Germany. Yeah. yeah. And some big companies uh, which come here to make big money, but only forces them yeah the and countries we, and yeah. we heard about criminality in the north in the northern part of ghana yes when you came where the perceptions a reality um we saw part of them yes. yeah we saw a lot of nestle signs yeah we don't um and we saw a lot of like their children working and that's not what we have in germany and um yeah Weren't you told that? It's not totally true. Weren't you told that Africans live on trees? We are like monkeys. 
Why don't you tell that? No, we, we never heard in, that in no. German. <laughs> the people which say that are not, not intelligent. Yeah, and it's not the true thing. That's it's like all the people think it's like that, but it's not the true thing that the people in German. We're from that younger generation. Maybe it's the older people who think but like yeah, that. But I think you might have heard about this perception that the people are saying and that we live on trees. Lives on trees. I had never heard it before. Okay. Not in a, in a um, right. Um, way of thinking. Mm -hmm. No. So, what were of the perceptions of which, when you came here, it was not true? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Is Africa the future? Is Africa the future? No, I think the Chinese. <laughs> country is the future. We know that Chinese are the future. Yeah, in Germany we see that a lot of projects are from China and here too. Every every third or fourth job is with Chinese signs, China malls and so on. But we are the same people um, um, providing this sort of resources to Chinese. The Chinese, the way that they are, they are developing, we are giving them the resources. You, yeah. The resources, yeah, that's true. true. There are a lot of resources in, in Africa. But you don't think Africa is the future? That's a hard question. Yeah. Maybe yes. Okay, so if yes, <laughs> can you justify it for us? Yeah, I think only because of that resources. Because if Africans would use their resources by their own, they would be the future. Yeah, they can grow. Very yeah. fast. Yeah. Yeah. So wh you've been here for a month and a half. Yeah. What are some of the things you think you are doing it badly of which we should, you know, improve upon so that our country will develop? We already talked about that. We talked about the languages. Yeah. We think maybe there are too many languages in that in one country. Germany is bigger than Ghana and we have only one language. Every part of Germany you are, you can more or less understand the people there. So communication is easier and that makes like organization easier. easier yeah. So what do you suggest? Um create one language. <laughs> create one, oh, yeah. one language? Yeah. Yes. Alright. So apart from Ghana, which of the countries, African countries have you been in? Um only Morocco for now. Or, or Tunisia. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Alright. So your last wish to Africans. Our last wish? Um stay happy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, make good party. <laughs> so I, I would like to tell your colleagues, as take, use this platform, tell your colleagues that, hey, what are you going to tell your colleagues about Africa? Uh, we love come Africa. Here, come, yeah, come, come here, come here and Africa. visit Africa. Yeah. Tell them, tell them. Yeah. Come here. And it's visit a nice Africa. place. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I want to say thanks for having time for me. And my association yeah. with you, I've learned something that not all white people or foreigners have negative perceptions about Africa sure and I keep that in mind. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. All right. This is um, a YouTube channel where Draftman is possible to showcase uh, Africa to the world. Okay. So sometimes we ask foreigners what their perception about Africa when they come to their own country. And uh, they think Africa is the future. Uh, what are some of the things that Africa is doing that is forcing us to make I don't know when. Hey, come on. Yeah, five waiting minutes, I think. Yeah, we're waiting for food. Yeah, I'm going to wait for that food. Ah. <laughs> what did you order? I ordered um, rice. Okay. Rice and um, uh, yum. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ambassador Vix, and I visit the interest of Ghana and Africa.